Commander Blight was one of the most fiercely loyal clone commanders in the Grand Army of the Republic and always carried the primary goal of completing his mission. His loyalty to the Republic was ultimately stronger than his loyalty to the Jedi however, leading him to gun down his own general Aayla Sakura. So what happened to Commander Blight after Order 66 and the Clone Wars Season 7? I'm going to break down exactly what happened to Commander Blight after Order 66 and how he came to serve Darth Vader and work alongside the Inquisitors. So before we get into it, remember to hit the subscribe button with notifications on for more awesome Star Wars lore content. At the moment only 12% of you who are watching this video are subscribed, so if you do enjoy the content remember to subscribe for more. In canon, unfortunately, we literally only know one single detail about the life of Commander Blight after Order 66. This detail comes from the newest version of the Star Wars character encyclopedia and states, after Order 66 turns him against the Republic, Bly serves the Empire. That is the only fact we know about him after Order 66 in canon, but in Legends, Commander Bly has a very deep and interesting story. Let me know down below whether or not you can forgive Commander Bly for his betrayal of Aayla Sakura on Felucia. Shortly after the death of Master Aayla Sakura on the planet Felucia, Commander Bly continued to serve directly under Palpatine's Galactic Empire as one of the few clone commanders that remained in service after the Clone Wars. Commander Bly's first mission under the Empire came on the planet Utusk where he was ordered to control a protest rally on the surface. He was sent to this planet with fellow clone trooper CT6734 nicknamed Gala. After a short time, Bly was contacted directly by Lord Vader himself who reminded him that he still had incomplete missions for the Empire on his record and offered him a chance to finally repay his debts. Because it was Darth Vader who asked him, he obviously had no choice but to agree to the offer and was sent back to Coruscant immediately. While on the planet he met with the director of Imperial Intelligence named Armand Isard as well as two Inquisitors. The two Inquisitors were known as Antinus Tremaine and Lanu Paik and they were currently tasked with tracking down two rogue Jedi Padawans named Ekria and Logan. Now this next part may be a bit weird for those of you who haven't read much Legends material, but Barriss Offee was actually on Felucia during the time of Order 66 with Commander Bly and Aayla Sakura. She was even given her own apprentice called Zonda who fought alongside her in the war. The reason this is weird is because The Clone Wars Season 5 is actually considered part of Legends continuity which means that Barriss Offee was released from prison very shortly after her attack on the Jedi Temple and was even given her own apprentice after that. But let me know down below if you want me to make a video that covers Barriss Offee in Legends, it's a pretty great story. So because Barriss' apprentice Zonda had already been executed by Vader days earlier, Commander Bly was free to focus on the two rogue Jedi that had escaped the grasp of Darth Vader. Bly argued with the director of Imperial Intelligence, who didn't think he had what it took to complete the mission, but Commander Bly quickly replied saying that only one person standing here has worked with the Jedi. The two Jedi fugitives were then traced down to a small apartment on Coruscant, allowing Bly and the Inquisitors to finally come face to face with them. As they arrived at the Coruscant apartment though, a large blast charge was detonated, tearing the apartment to shreds. The leading Inquisitor, Tremaine, was not fooled however, and noticed a small speeder fleeing the area only moments before the blast went off. Commander Bly and the two Inquisitors then boarded their own vehicle and wildly chased the two rogue Jedi through the crowded sky lanes of Coruscant. While they were being dramatically chased, one of the rogue Jedi, Ekria, jumped off of his speeder in hopes of escape. The other rogue Jedi apprentice who remained on the speeder was not so lucky though, as his speeder arrived right at the platform where Darth Vader was preparing to board his shuttle. Logan was quickly captured by Vader and his guards, but Commander Bly and the Inquisitors continued to chase for Ekria. Following that, Commander Bly was able to use his clone visor to discover that Ekria had boarded a freight shuttle that was headed to the same planet as Vader and his captured friend. Ekria was secretly following Vader waiting for the perfect opportunity to strike and free her friend from his grip. Unfortunately, she accidentally revealed her location when Darth Vader shockingly blinded a man with his lightsaber, similarly to how Kanan Jarrus was blinded by Darth Maul. Her complete shock at the situation unfortunately revealed her location, allowing Commander Bly and his men to open fire and kill the young Jedi. Or at least they thought they did. After this, the other Jedi apprentice went into a deep rage calling upon the dark side to force push Commander Bly against the wall, knocking him out cold. When Commander Bly woke up from his daze, he 
he witnessed Darth Vader in a lightsaber duel with Logan. Vader, of course, got the upper hand, stabbing him to death and pushing him to a very large fall. Darth Vader then congratulated Commander Bly for the successful mission and forgave him for his previous debt to the Empire. Unknown to Vader and Bly though, the two Jedi did in fact survive. So that is exactly what happened to Commander Bly after the Clone Wars and Order 66 in Legends. I really hope we get some more stories about Bly's service to the Empire in canon, but for now we literally only have one line in the official encyclopedia that confirms it. Thanks so much for watching, if you enjoyed the video, remember to subscribe to the channel and let me know if you can forgive Bly for joining Darth Vader. Cheers guys, hope to see you in the next one.